with we'll talk about uh, money grow. What is money grow? Uh, why did we start money grow? Um, money grow started by small business owners. We realized that as small business owners, we had certain challenges, and we thought if we came together under the auspices of a cooperative, we will join forces and uh, be able to achieve certain things uh, better as a group. I'll give you an example. You find that as a small business owner, you have an opportunity, you have a tender, or somebody has given you a business. It requires a certain amount of capital, and you want to raise that capital. You find that if you go to the bank, the bank is asking for collateral, uh, you look at the interest rate, uh, they, are, they are looking for so many things. They want audited accounts. Uh, and sometimes when you say, okay, the banks are not working with us uh, so well, let's go on the street. Let's look for other uh, people that um, provide uh, financial uh, services. You find that um, they charge very high interest rates, uh, charity. Okay. So we said, what can we do uh, to grow uh, our businesses as uh, small business owners? Right. So we said, I think the best way is if business owners, small business owners, came together, began to save and pull their resources together and begin to lend each other finances so that they can grow their businesses. That's how Money Grow was started. And um, along the way, we began to add other things. We realized that, uh, again, the challenges that we are having in the, in the country is that it's not so easy to build your own house. It's not so, busy, it's so easy for people running the, the transport businesses to acquire their own vehicles. So we decided to include all those uh, services under the auspices of Money Grow. Great. Thank you. So that sounds like it's really going to transform the economy. Definitely, so Charity. Definitely. How is this going to work? Can you please explain how our economy, especially during mm -hmm. this COVID period, how is it going to help to transform this economy? Wonderful. Um, the other thing is this. We, we looked at the economy of Zambia. Mm -hmm. We looked at the challenges that this country uh, is facing. Right. And we realized that 2.1 million Zambians are in the informal sector. Yes. Only 800,000 uh, Zambians are in the informal sector. Mm -hmm. So if you wanted to transform an economy, the majority are in the informal sector. And we did a bit of mathematics. We said if only 25% mm -hmm. of people in the informal sector improved their businesses and employed one other person, right. Guess what, uh, Charity? We are looking at 500,000 additional jobs. So that means we're going to have more jobs. We are going business. to have more jobs. The because economy... The, businesses, the small businesses are growing to bigger businesses. Thus, they're becoming employers. Themselves. Definitely. And this okay. is what Money Grow is trying to do. Okay. Money Grow is trying to look at that small business owner. Mm -hmm. How do we help that small business owner okay. to grow their business so that next day they can employ another person? Uh, next day, they can buy more stock and the economy will grow. So now you're talking more about the informal sector. Yes. Um, is it only for informal sector or this is also open because it's a cooperative society, Definitely. Right? Yes. Definitely. So does it mean that even somebody who is in the formal sector can also become part of money growth? Definitely. Uh, thank you for that uh, question, Charity, because the truth is we are looking at the small business owner. Right. Yes. So it means whether you are in the informal Okay. I am in the formal yeah, sector. Sometimes we have, you know, side jobs. Even when we're in the formal sector, I mean, you might be running a small business and you're also working. Correct. Okay. Correct. And uh, I'll tell you one thing. Mm. Um, we've come to realize that the small business um, terrain. Right. Today, the guys that are now working in the informal sector, mm -hmm. formal but small business, right. you find degree orders now because. Yes. You know, yeah, to, to get jobs uh, is becoming difficult. Yeah. So go to the market. Mm -hmm. There are degree orders there. Yeah. Go on the street. Mm -hmm. There are degree orders. I'm a degree order, but I'm running a small business uh, formally mm -hmm. and informally. So, yes, charity. Uh, Money Grow is um, tackling small business owners who are informal mm -hmm. and formal. As long as you're a small business owner, mm -hmm. you belong to Money Grow. Join us and let's see how we. Uh, transform the economy and your business together. Great. Thank you so much, Mr. Schiller. So basically the economy, <clears throat> we'll see a recovery in the economy, but then how are we going to do this? And I think I'm going to uh, pose that question to Mrs. Mobanga. Is that right? Yes. yes. Why do you think Manigro decided to do a training program on TV? Yeah. Thank you so much, uh, Charit, for that good question. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, when you're talking about uh, um, a small business uh, 
person. Right. I'm very excited okay. because most of the people are in good position mm -hmm. in everywhere in, in the society. Mm -hmm. You find that they are coming from uh, uh, parents who were running small businesses mm -hmm. yeah. in this country. Okay. So now well, you would find that a business, uh, a small business owner mm -hmm. uh, would do business, but uh, without good knowledge okay. yes they won't have enough knowledge on how they are going to do their business 